I moved out here to California to pursue my dreams of being a musician. I'm, I'm a lucky man. I get to do what I love for a living. My name is Michael Jones. A lot of people call me Wax. My birthday is April 5th. I'm from a very small town, a very small town. And where I grew up, the television and the radio might as well have been on, moon, on, the, on the moon or Mars. And uh, people from my hometown are always like, I just can't believe you had the balls, man. You had the balls to move out there. And I'm like, I got in a car and drove. It, it didn't feel like balls to me. Like I just, I know that the first thing that I said that's what I want to do was like people like Def Leppard, you know? I saw them playing guitar and just shredding like that and everybody in the audience going crazy. And I think that, that that was the first thing that made me want to play guitar, which was my real first introduction into being a musician myself and not just being a fan. I started taking guitar lessons when I was in sixth grade. It all started there. I just wanted to shred. I was born to shred, I guess, you know? <laughs> still working on it. Still working on it. 29 years after that, I'm still working on it. Uh, for the last 10 years, I kind of made a living off of having videos on YouTube that gained some popularity. So I was able to make, I make albums, I tour. I had a number one song in Austria for four weeks. It was really weird. I wrote a song about a girl that was a nymphomaniac, and it was, it was like a mixture of hip hop and mariachi music, and it became big in Austria, just like I planned, you know? But I had, it was number one on the Billboard charts for four weeks, kids. It was above Get Lucky. Above Get Lucky. Yeah. <laughs> Even bigger than my love of music is my hate of regular jobs. I'll go on the record with that. I'll go on the record. You'll know when it's time to quit your regular gig. But the fact, the, the truth of the matter is, you gotta pay your bills. So find something that you can stomach. My favorite job was like delivery jobs. Like for a guy who d who's into music, if you deliver pizza every time you're out, you can like listen to your beats and kind of write in your head. You don't have the boss on your back. You know, you're just in, out there in your car. So I recommend for anybody who's trying to get into a creative field, especially music, a delivery job is actually a pretty good one. You make good money too, good tips. When I was younger, skateboarding was everything to me. I was never great. I was never like great like to be pro or something, but it was everything to me. And I every every day I played music and every day I'd ride my skateboard. It's like this, cre it's a very creative sport. It's like individual, it's, it's just you can do whatever you want. And I brought my skateboard today because you can keep being creative, you can keep having new ideas, you can keep having new thoughts, but your body doesn't accept certain types of creativity. Like, your body will tell you, you can't skateboard anymore, man. It's just a representation to me of, of, um, of, of youth, and, so, and we try to hold on to youth, but that skateboard, it'll, it, you can't hold on to that shit, man. I'm turning 39 this year, and when I turned 29, I was like, oh, I got one more year in my 20s. And when you turn 39, you're just like, I'm 40. You know, I'm, I'm 38, I'm already, when people ask me my age, I'm like, I'm 40. When they say, why don't you want to go to the club? I say, I'm 40. Why don't you want to go to this nightclub and get a table? You want to get a table at a nightclub? No, I'm 40, even though I'm only 38. You know, you can acknowledge it faster. When I turned 30, I didn't like pe telling people I was 30. But when I turned 40, there's almost a pride to it. Like, what do you know? I'm 40, you know? Unless you're talking to a 50-year-old. Happy birthday to everybody born on April 5th. Thank you for watching. We're uploading an episode every single day featuring a different person. Please like, share, and subscribe. We really appreciate your support.